translated into emergencies i'm just going to go fast because normally we don't find these in the emergencies normally we go ahead with three emergencies hypoglycemia thyrotoxicosis and uh, ceh which is congenital adrenal hypoplasia hypoglycemia is basically uh, you have to uh, see like i told you prenatal history natal history go with uh, whenever the baby is born check whether the mother was diabetic or not uh, whether there was maternal hyperglycemia uh or not the fetal pancreas response to this protection so uh <clears throat> the treatment as we all know once we find that the baby sugar levels are less than uh, 40 uh normally now we take it as 50 then you have to give a bolus of uh, <clears throat> you have to give a bolus of 10% dextrose at a level of 2 ml per kg you can repeat it again please do not go ahead and give 25% and 50% of a dextrose which we have we, which we have found in most of the cases which they go ahead with and if you find that the uh, sugar levels are not going uh, are not getting okay with that then you can basically start with 2 milli uh, 6 mg per kg per minute of uh, insulin uh, sorry the uh, dextrose infusion Uh, if that also doesn't go you can increase it to 8 mg per kg per minute then go to 10 but if you have to go beyond 10 mg per kg per minute then in, it will not be possible to infuse the baby on a peripheral line so preferably uh, prefer to go with a pick line or any other central line so as we can uh, go ahead with the higher uh, 12 mg per kg per minute of dextrose solutions Okay, now thyroid toxicosis. This is a very uncommon condition. Only one percent of pregnancies of the mother with Graves' disease. Uh, the risk of the baby is uh, born to the third mother is negligible. So I am just uh, going very fast on this uh, because normally uh, these babies are uh, uh, now we have started doing the thyroid levels for all the new nets at birth. So these uh, babies are very less likely that they come into the emergencies with us. So. i am just uh, giving potential uh, findings baby basically heart rate or tachycardia shock hyperthermia pallor and the child can come in congenital heart disease now the treatment basically is based, uh, go with uh, propranolol at 0.1 mg per kg iv uh, ptu 5 to 10 mg per kg and potassium iodine 1 to 4 drop per orally but normally like i told you now